So uh, I, I, I'm not sure the exact number, but it's some, some number on, on the order of $50 million. Uh, so so the, the <laughs> man, fate loves irony next level. Um, so I used to be close friends with Larry Page, and I would stay at his house, and we'd have these conversations long into, long into the evening um, about AI, and I, I, would, I would be constantly urging him to be careful about the danger of, of AI, and, um, and, and, and he, he, just, he was really not concerned about the danger of AI and was quite cavalier about it. Um, and um, and, and, and at, at the time, uh, Google, especially after their acquisition of DeepMind, had three quarters of the world's AI talent. They had obviously a lot of computers and a lot of money. Um, so it was a unipolar world for, for AI. And, and we've got a unipolar world, but, but the, the person who, who controls that does not, or at least did, did not seem to be concerned about AI safety. That, that, sound, that sounded like a real problem. So, um, and, and then the final straw was uh, Larry calling me a speciest. Uh, for being um, pro-human consciousness <laughs> instead of machine consciousness, and I'm like, well, yes, I guess I am. I, I am a speciesist, and and, and uh, so and, right. And, and so you <laughs> helped to the creation of OpenAI.